Hey guys, Jeff, Chief Head Flipper here, of my storage units, and I want to have a little discussion about some quite often overlooked item that can make you quite a bit of money. Now, mostly these are going to be for local sales because they're a little bit large and in charge, and well, you can ship them, depends on if you find one good enough price range, but generally they're going to be for local sales. What I'm talking about are vacuum cleaners. Yeah, vacuum cleaners. I find them all the time inside the road, you know after people move out of like apartment buildings or just piled up by the you know the dumpsters and usually they think they don't work well guess what yeah they currently don't work but i'll tell you what you can fix them really really easy now I'll show you what to look for now here we have one of the typical ones you're going to find that i actually love finding are these bissell vacuum cleaners all the time people think these things are broken no longer work but they're usually just clogged. That's it. So if you come down here, most of them have a little latch. Take this out. Ew, nasty. Take this out. Ugh, grody. And a lot of times, here will be clogged. This filter is obviously clogged. This person most likely thought this thing was broken. But I can take this outside. I'm not going to do it right here because, well, I'm in my storage unit. You can pound this thing out and get all of this crud out of here. And, you know, clean up, you know, in the bin. And then if it's like that also right here, turn this little guy here. Ugh, disgusting. Yeah, usually this thing here is clogged all up too or there's things up in there. And then also what you want to check, flip it around. You're gonna have a clog somewhere in here. This guy here pops right off. And a lot of times there's a clog right there or right in this hose. This one here is good in the hose. And they're really super easy to pull apart. Same with down here. I'm not gonna do it because it does take about two hands. But a lot of times you can find this thing right here is just clogged up a little bit. And it right here in this joint. So you pop this puppy here off and you clean this thing out. You know, you can do it with like a stick or twig, or I usually use a needle and those pliers. They come right out. Then flip around the back. And like right here. Ew, look at that. Disgusting. But you yank this stuff off. And then you check. Let's see, where is it? I don't know if you can see this, but right here is the hole where it goes into that hose I showed you on the other side. A lot of times right here will be clogged. And all you do is you pull all this crud out of here and the darn thing works perfectly. So, granted, these Bissell vacuum cleaners don't fetch a huge price tag, but they're super easy to fix. Actually, you're not broken, you're not really fixing it, you're just cleaning them. And I, I can throw that thing on Facebook Marketplace for 50 bucks or at my garage sale for like 50 bucks, and it'll be gone in like two or three days. From something I picked off the side of the road, maybe 10 minutes of work, boom, $50 in my pocket. And who knows, maybe I'll see something else while I'm driving around. Now, I don't really go out specifically looking for them, but if I see them, I pick them up. Now, when I lived in an apartment building, I would find these probably once or twice per month. Yeah, that's pretty good. Now I'm not in an apartment building anymore, so I don't see them as much, but I'm cruising around, doing my other stuff. If I see one, especially a Bissell like that, I stop, I grab it, I throw it in the back. Now I'll usually grab some of the other ones, too. Especially, usually the newer ones, the really old ones, sometimes are okay. But you see a vacuum inside the road, grab it. Most likely it's not broken, it's just clogged. And really, really fast and easy. You can, fix, you can unclog it, resell it, make yourself some money all right well if you like this click below subscribe and come back for more tips and is there anything that you guys often find the side of the road that you just don't know why you always find it and people think it's broken that you just fix it up really quick let me know down below you have a great day keep on listing keep on selling keep on making money you have a great day bye bye